So we're back in Bel Air, California. We are another property designed and built by Ramtin Ray Nosrati. Amazing, amazing designer and builder. This house is just shy of 14 million bucks. It's 7,000 square feet. It's a little different to what we normally show you, but you're gonna love it. It has five bathrooms, five bedrooms, and some other great features. Let's go see. Ready, Adam? Ready. Start off with a regular sized door. How rare is that? I told you, it's different to what we normally show you. This is a normal sized door. Don't know what to say about it. It's beautiful, but it's normal. Normal is good. How about this? You can see the, the theme that this is a Nosrati design. It's similar to the mega mansions that he built. So this would be the, the living room, right? When you walk in the door, you're right there, TV. Spectacular views. Do you want to have a peek out the window? Let's do it. Should we do outside areas as we go? Because yeah. I'm just noticing Let's one. Let's have a peek. We haven't been around this house, so this is kind of experimental for us. So you're joining us on the tour. How lovely. Look how nice this is. So this would be courtyard number one. I love all this outdoor space. Fabulous picture on the wall. Look at that picture. Styling dude in that picture. Ooh la la. <laughs> Sorry. So this is the dining room, which is, it's, you know what? It's casual, but formal at the same time. Is that an oxymoron? No, I get what you mean. Right? Well, you could it, eat here just with a couple of you, or you could host a dinner party. Correct. And this is so kind of laid back and fun, the way that it's been put together. I love these chairs. I mean, not something you would think about buying for your dining room, but it looks perfect. And I so really like rather, the wood and the plants as well. That little love pop the of green. Light. Imagine changing a bulb in the middle. How would you get to it? <laughs> it's true, actually, yeah. yeah Do you remember these little light bulbs from school where you would like build circuits with them? They were like little yes, teeny tiny ones. But I think these are the advanced ones. I think these are probably LED. I think so too. But again, lovely. And the roof, do you see that thing on the ceiling? It's not the roof. It's uh, like a drop down wooden panel. Very nicely done. Here's the office and the greenery. It really does make a difference. Window greenery, and it doesn't impede the view. And there you have it. Nice car. Very nice car. Nice wheels. Did you hear what I just said? I, he I heard what you said. And I, I thought you misspoke, so I left it be. Didn't want you to correct yourself. You grow it's growing on you, right? I was looking at my truck. <laughs> okay, what do we have here? We have a loo with pebbles in the sink. I've never seen this before. And I love it. What I like a, that. What a great idea. How would you clean it? Good question. You have bit to of, spray it, yeah, right? You spray, spray it with a disinfectant. Yeah. But what a great, great idea. Why is there no electric toilet? So if I bought this house, the first thing I do, swan toilet goes in there. That's so cool. This is a wine cellar room, which, you know, you see these huge ones in houses, right? Total waste of time. This is adequate. You'd get what? One, two, three, four, five, six, probably 60 bottles. Easily. How many people have more than 60 bottles in their house? Nobody, right? If I'm doing my job right, I have none left. There you go. Bar? Where's the kitchen? Down here. So oh. I, just, I just noticed that. Because I'm thinking dining room, we should do the kitchen, right? Um, I mean, we're already here now. We can walk through to and that. And then we come back? Yeah, yeah. All right, let's do that. But I was just thinking how cool that there's this sort of entertaining wing of the house almost. Right, so here's the bar. So yeah, wine, bar. This is very nice. Okay, what do you think this is in here? I think, hmm, garage. Good guess. Come on in. Again, once again, it's themed like a Nosrati building. Three cars easily and lifts, right? Yeah. Why do garages echo the way they do? There's just no soft furnishings, are there? Another lovely outdoor area. Beautiful. Wow, this is just... There's more outdoor than indoor, right? Yeah. I mean, living space, beautiful barbecue. So yeah, nice. This is a dream. I love all this outdoor space. You've got a refrigerator, you've got the grill, drawers. Don't know what those cupboards are. There's storage cupboards, I guess. Harpoon. <laughs> <laughs> There's a rotisserie, right? I think so, yeah. Are you shocked that I know what that is? Um, no, because you're a cultured man. There you go. Cultured man, indeed. I will, I will take that as a huge compliment thank you how pretty is this it's beautiful so yeah the driveway for everybody watching is up there so you sort of drive in and then drive around the back of the building and you get to see all of this and yeah, the house is actually below street level isn't yeah. it yeah so this here is i guess another living area it's like a 
like a TV den. And then back here, we've got a couple of bedrooms. Oh, and there's a surprise. I didn't expect that there. But look, let's go and explore it and we'll come back in the bedroom. What a beautiful pool. Yeah, this and is fire lovely. Pit. Yeah, there's so much outdoor space here. Yeah. So much outdoor space. This house is, what did we say it was? Just under $14 million. Yeah. It's a lot of house for just under $14 million. I know that's a lot of money, but this is Bel Air, California, just like Beverly Hills, same price tag. And this is a lot of house. We've seen a lot less for a lot more. A hundred percent we have. Yeah, wow. this is the perfect size pool as well. It's all you need, right? How many people swim full Olympic lengths at their home? Not many. I love this place. It's really kind of, and it's so secluded yeah, and private and tucked away. Literally nobody, there's no, like these guys would have to have binoculars. That one, maybe when it's finished, they might have a telescope up there. But you'd need a telescope. Yeah. And if they, if they wanted to go to the trouble of using a telescope, God bless you, <laughs> right? <laughs> Enjoy. It, it would also be very easy just to put in some screening. I don't right think here. you'd need to. I, I, I kind of like it. Yeah. It's like, and I see up there, we haven't been up there, but there's two decks. So this is going to be fun. Let's go look. Let's go find the kitchen. Oh, what a beautiful kitchen. Double island. Gorgeous, right? This is absolutely beautiful. And you have access to both of the outside areas. To the right, the big one, and to the left, well, it's also large. Wow, how clever. Somehow, even though this house is very big and modern and spacious, it feels very cozy and- It's like a house. Yeah, right? it's yeah. It's not yeah. cold. Exactly, yeah. It feels like a house, not like a mansion, if that makes sense. Although it is. Well, what technically is a mansion? How big is a mansion? Isn't it anything over 6,000 square feet? I think it might be less than that, maybe 5,000 square it? feet. I think so. Mille. Coffee maker, my favorite. I guess this is a fridge. Oh, that's nice. Blast of cold air. Oh, isn't that nice? Nicer. Freezer. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I know. It's really hot. So we have all the doors open so that we can show you guys the place and the air conditioning is not switched on. So it's a little on the warm side, but this is great. What would you put here? Just a table right you don't really need one you've got this haven't you yeah it's Nothing. nice to have it open yeah absolutely yeah. love the lights too honestly you could almost put like a little couch and then have a tv in there and have this almost be like a little snug area you really could right yeah you really could so bedroom number one or two or three or however you want to count it lovely shower I'm addicted to electric toilets. Do you guys know I'm addicted to these electric toilets? Once you've had them, you can't be without them. You need swan toilets. Sound like an advert, don't I? I'm going to call them. They're amazing. Another lovely bedroom. Seriously, Adam, should I call them and see if I can get a discount for our viewers' toilets? On swan toilets? Swan toilets. Best toilets ever. They? And they're not that crazy expensive. Yeah, I mean, everybody loves the singing toilets and the But the these are, these are, toilets. they're fully automated. You know, you walk up to it, you do what you do, you walk away, it sanitizes, it does its thing, it flushes, and it's got 5 million different settings, and yeah, I should do it, right? Yeah. Are you going to go in there, or did If you you're forget? watching Swan Toilets, if you're watching, I will be contacting you, and you will be giving us a discount code. Am I nuts? <laughs> yeah. What happens if they won't? Do we cut this out? Yeah. Okay. So. Yeah. <laughs> Every, everybody should have one though. Seriously, Adam. Oh, laundry room. Not huge, but totally adequate, right? Yeah. Do not touch the moss wall. And it feels so moist. Yeah, it's very uh, spongy, isn't it? Spongy. We will not touch it. So again, this is a living wall that doesn't require any maintenance at all. Does it grow? Does it get long? I don't know. I honestly don't know. I've never known moss not need water. Yeah, I mean, it would die. You would think it would die. Yeah. All right, let's go upstairs.
love the staircase. Look at the chandelier. Isn't that fun? That is spectacular. Wow. Which way? Left. L this way? Yeah. Again, this is just spectacular. This is a guest room or a family member room with unbelievable views and access outside. Look at this tiny table. Oh, it's for kiddies <laughs> and tiny little sofas. Well, they're actually not these are, tiny. Yeah, these are normal human size. Wow, so clever. Such a, a big outside area on this, this floor as well. Wow, look, it goes all the way around. It does. So you could get visitors from over there. Yeah, I seriously love all of this outdoor space. I do too. Beautiful. And then here we have the bathroom. Nicely done. Beautiful marble again. God, I love the marble. Do you think marble will go out of fashion? I don't think it ever has, right? No, I agree. Because I think maybe the colors of it you know, used to be that, that mottledy beige stuff. Mm -hmm. um, but that's kind of, that's kind of gone out of fashion, but it's still very usable and practical. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, perfect for you kids. And they have the nice theme of the wood on the ceilings. And these walls are also fun. They're, they, you know, rather than having just plain white walls. Yeah. It's all textured. Let's go this way. Is this the master? I think this is the master. It must be the master, right? I guess, unless that's it. No, this is probably the master. This is probably the master. It's got a beautiful balcony, fireplace, lovely, lovely room, yeah, big beautiful. TV. Yeah, this has to be the, the master. Steam, shower, rain head. That would be like a monsoon at that height, right? <laughs> Look at that. That's, so cool. That would be a nice tub to your right. Yeah, so have, a, have a dunk in. Yeah. So if anybody's wondering what all of that stuff is down there, those are the units used, I was going to say to build a house, but I think it's a school. I think it is a school, yeah. Two loos. I'm not saying anything. Very nice though. Yeah, lovely. Okay, closet. Ooh, somebody has good taste. Van Cleef. Ah, Van Cleef. Nice closet. This is a nice closet, not big enough for me, but it's a nice closet. Big closet, right? This is big enough for three normal people. Yeah, right? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. Okay, let's go see what we have on this end. Also very lovely. Whoa, look at the size of this balcony. Oh my God. Wow. Oh my gosh, look out here. What have you got? Hold on, hold on. Before we go through, let me just because otherwise you're gonna rush through. Let's just see this. I got excited I know, I know you did. Lovely bathroom. It's interesting that they're putting the toilets like behind the doors in here. Yeah, well, yeah, you're hidden, right? Yeah, again, lovely. Beautiful zebra marble. Or ze zebra. Zebra, as the Americans say. And then they have the closets rather than walking, they have a whole wall of closets, very nicely done. Very nice. All right, what okay. are you excited about? You'll see. Don't look to the left. Okay. Would you say this is a huge balcony this for this bedroom? This is an impressive deck. This is nothing. Look over here. Ho Can holy moly. Can you believe it? Wow. I mean, come on. 14 million. Yeah. How? I don't understand how. Think about the stuff that we've seen. I know. Look how nicely this is done, Adam, here on the wall. So the outside is actually all tiled and then the wood. It's gorgeous. And then there's another upstairs. Seriously, this is an unbelievably beautiful home. For the money as well. I mean, think about the cost. And I'm not saying $14 million isn't a lot of money. No, no, no. It's a lot of money. But compared to all the others. But for where it is and what you get, this is quite stunning. Ooh, Adam's place. Oh my word. Very impressive. Very impressive. They even finished the top of the roof off with the grass. Yeah. So, so well thought about. This is quite special. And here we have another bar. I know the first thing that you would do is you'd put a beer tap I in. I would. Nice kegerator. Refrigerator. Ice maker. Yeah. Huge. Another fire pit. And the most glorious view. Do you know what else I like? The fact that this here looks like it's not ever going to be built on. Yeah, I don't think it ever could be. You would have no access to it. Yeah, exactly. So you've sort yeah, of wonderful. 
yeah just got this nice little yeah. nature even reserve. looking down you can see on the other balcony all the plants and the way it's done really quite spectacular i'm amazed yeah i didn't expect this i didn't either i didn't either well i hope you enjoyed it as much as we did filming it it's rampton ray nostrati all the information will be in the description hit the like button hit the subscribe button hit the bell go shopping well uh talking of going shopping what's this sir oh this is very um, sparkly i bought this from happy jewelers when we did a video with wires only, remember? I do remember. I'm not doing any more videos with them. It costs me so much money <laughs> each time. Pretty though, right? I love it. Really like that. So there we have it. Go shopping. Did I say that? I don't know where to go shopping, but go shopping. Um, yeah, bye.